Hi, my name is Chris. We're here today again at Bountiful Acres. Today we're going to show you how to make a vegetable and herb window box. A great thing for your deck or patio or a windowsill in your kitchen to grow fresh herbs and vegetables to have them all season long. Um, first I'm going to start off by putting some nice um, organic potting mix in our container. We have a gardener's um, bumper crop we're using today that is rich in all kinds of nutrients. And what we're gonna do is try to make it a little bit more formal and pretty instead of just plain uh, herbs and vegetables in a, a container. So we're using this um, lavender topiary for the center to give us some height. And you just wanna make sure you break up your root system. And we're gonna put that in the center as a focal point. front of that we have some dwarf bush basil and I'm going to put that in front of our container with a nice contrast against the gray and then in the front we want to put some things that are going to creep over the edge so rosemary is another great cooking herb and we can put two of these in the front. So we're gonna make it kind of symmetrical, this window box. So it's a little bit more formal looking. And herbs like full sun, um, you'd wanna give them um, organic fertilizer at least once every two weeks through the season to keep them healthy and green. lemon thyme for the front again to creep over. Just want to tuck that up in the front. Here's a silver thyme. Very fragrant. I'm going to use some golden oregano. So this is a nice chartreuse green color to break up all of the um, different other greens. Add some more soil as you need it. And herbs can go a little bit more on the dry side, so you don't want to be overwatering your herbs. Herbs like to tend to be more um, Mediterranean, so they like to go a little bit more dry to the touch than uh, always kept moist. So I'm going to use two of these on either side to brighten up the container. And you could use any herbs that of your choice that you use cooking uh, mostly with. So as you cut them and use them, you're actually trimming your plant as you go along. So it won't become overruly using these many plants because you're going to be nipping them and using them to cook with. Uh, we're going to put in uh, some parsley. This is a curly parsley. And in the front, I'm gonna use some tricolor sage. and that helps break up the green too the, with the variegated foliage. And then for the back of the window box, I'm just gonna use a, just a different mix of different types of lettuce. This is a, um, a leaf mix, a mucilin mix, which is really nice. And it has these great, uh, some red lettuce. These are in individual little cells. And I do like the red to break everything up. And then in the back, I'm gonna use some leaf lettuce. 
I'm gonna add a little bit more soil. Always make sure your uh, container is well drained, that it has um, a hole at the bottom of the container so it does drain properly. And I'm just gonna fill the back up with some more leaf lettuce on each side. There you have it. There's our vegetable and herb window box.